In the video, 23-year-old private first class Bo Bergdahl appears in good health. Questioned in English by his captors, he says he's being treated like a guest. But in the 28 well, minutes of footage, he often looks downcast and says he's afraid. I'm scared I won't be able to go home. Uh, it is very un unnerving to be a prisoner. The U.S. military has reacted angrily to the release of the video. Well, we're, we're very unhappy with the exploitation, public ex exploitation of a prisoner and the humiliation that goes with that. That's a, a violation of international law. While the Taliban has claimed responsibility for the abduction, it is still unclear how the soldier went missing last month. The U.S. military says the incident is still under investigation. In the video, Private Bergdahl states he was lagging behind on patrol. And after more than two weeks in captivity, he becomes emotional talking about his family. I have a very, very good family that I love back home in America. And I miss them every day. <coughs> Then I'm gone. I miss them. And I'm afraid that I might never see them again. Back home in a written statement, that, uh, his father Bob Bergdahl says he hopes and prays for his son's safe return. The U.S. military is saying it is doing everything it can to get the soldier back safely, but insist there will be no negotiating with terrorists. Mandy Clark, CBS News, Kabul.